mindset of what's in it for me uh, and to heck with everybody else when that mindset is operationalized uh, in our government. That brings us to your weekend presidential brief. How significant are his comments? Well, Anna, Obama always says it best, but the backdrop here is that President Trump has consistently insulted President Obama. President Obama, for his, part, for his part, has more strategically reserved his candid assessments of President Trump for the campaign trail. Back in 2018, during the midterm election cycle, for example, he described President Trump as, among other things, a threat to our democracy. Now, during another critical uh, election moment in the 2020 election cycle, President Obama did something that I remember him doing in the Situation Room. He laid out the stakes, in this case, the stakes of a second term for President Trump. He pointed to the DOJ's efforts to drop criminal charges against Michael Flynn, for example, because the fact is that if President Trump is elected to a second term, these Flynn developments may just be the tip of the iceberg in terms of the perversion of our rule of law by the president's personal priorities. President Obama appears focused on injecting urgency into this campaign season, and I personally found his words very effective. The